Welcome to another edition of Point Cast. I'm Tony. And that would make me Tyler. Tyler, I'm getting kind of hungry. We're on the midway. That's perfect because we got lots of fun foods here. We do have fun foods like funnel cakes, cheese on a stick, corn dogs, and the new chippery uh, that sells the handmade chips. Delicious. They are delicious. And, but I've always wondered, how do they make those fun foods? Let's go find out. Okay. All right, we're here at the Corral with Gary Gokenauer, director extraordinaire of Cedar Point Foods. How you doing, Gary? Great, how are you, Tyler? Oh, I'm great, I'm great. Uh, what are we gonna make today, sir? We're gonna make famous Happy. Cedar Point funnel cakes. Oh, that's awesome. All right, I'm gonna take you step by step. Delicious homemade batter. We're gonna drop it into the fryer. Gary, how hot is that uh, that you're pouring it into there? 375 degrees. Toasty 375. Let the funnel cake come up a little bit and then we're gonna swirl it around, cross it back and forth. And how long is that gonna cook? It's gonna cook for about two minutes on this side and about a minute on the other side. What kind of toppings can they get on the funnel cakes? Here at the Corral, you can get our uh, signature Toffs Dairy soft serve ice cream. You can get fresh fruit toppings, but the best way to eat them is uh, by themselves with a nice ice cream cone on the side. What are we gonna top that with? Today we're gonna top it with just powdered sugar. That's a Cedar Point funnel cake. All right, Gary, we moved on to cheese on a stick. A Cedar Point staple, as you know. It is. It's one of the few places you can actually get cheese on a stick, Correct. right? Correct. A you good cheese go, on a stick. You can't go to the grocery store and get cheese on a stick no. in a package. So Jay's here. Jay's actually sticking the cheese. That's the first step, right? The first step is to check the, stick the cube cheese. It's a white American cheese. Looks good. And we're going to make this one. This is a cornbread batter we make here at Cedar Point. We're going to dip it in. Look at that. Is that the same batter that you use for corn dogs as well? Correct. And we're put it in the fryer. Unlike a lot of other parks, we still make cheese on a stick, corn dogs on a stick from scratch. We don't buy a pro pro product frozen and heat it up. We make the batter here, we stick the hot dogs here. And while that's cooking, we'll, st we'll actually make a corn dog. Corn dog's the same concept, you put the stick in. You Correct. St you stick the, uh, the hot dog and you put it in there, yep. dip it around. Shake off the excess batter. People don't know that there's this much manual labor that goes into these things. They're taking their hot oil bath. Get some of the little excess oil off. And a signature Cedar Point cheese on a stick. Look at that. That looks delicious. Always wear our personal protective equipment when we're working around fryers. And this is why I am not sticking my bare hands anywhere near the fryer, okay? I need these, these little appendages to write emails and blogs. Plus he has no idea how to do it. <laughs> That's why Gary's doing it today. And there you have it. Look at that, it's beautiful, a golden brown. All right, Gary, there's one more place, though, that's cooking food in a unique way, right? Brand new brand new place in the Frontier Trail. Chippery. The Chippery. Now, this is not just your normal bag of chips, right? No, Chippery is unique, and we, we're we really this, excited about it. We do this fresh every day, right? Every day, never a stale chip. Take a potato chip, put it in a machine, comes out a chip. We season it ourselves, and we sell them right there on the trail. You, uh, you wouldn't want to show us, would you? Sure, absolutely. All right, let's go check it out. Mm -hmm. 